Hey guys, what's up? It's Jeff Cavalier from Major League Insider Training. If you haven't already noticed, I'm kind of throwing you a little bit of a change up this week. Not literally, but in the way that I'm going to start to deliver some of my messages and emails to you guys. Um, I've been getting a lot of feedback from you and I thank you very much for that. We're actually going to talk about that a little bit more in a second. And a lot of questions from you and I want to step in front of the camera from now on, see if I can deliver my messages to you that way and interact with you. I want to get in touch with you a little bit more and I feel like doing it here in the form of a little bit of a video blog, I can get more direct contact with you, answer some of your questions and really give you all I got. What we're going to start to do this week is add a little portion where you guys get to interact with me directly in the form of questions. Our first person that we're going to take this week, I actually have his question right here. It was Ryan Middlebrook and he's from Peoria, Illinois. And Ryan wrote in, he said, Hey Jeff, thanks for all the great info you've been giving out. With the work I've already put in and, and I, on your program, my coach has told me that he can already notice a lot more pop in my swing. Balls that I used to hit for routine flies are now being driven into the gap for extra bases. My question is about warming up before I wor work out my upper body. I've been following the lower body active warm up whenever I, whenever I work out my legs and it's been making a huge difference. What should I do before an upper body workout? Thanks again for everything and keep up the good work, Ryan. And Ryan, I thank you for that question. And what I want to say too, guys, is that Ryan, you're going to be receiving the upcoming Load to Explode DVD, which is a $39.95 value. And I want, I'm going to send that out to you as soon as it comes out. You're the first guy to get your hands on it. And that's because you wrote in to me and uh, asked your question. So anybody else out there, if you have a question, I'm going to randomly select one every week and answer it right here inside of my version of my clubhouse and if you if you if your question is selected you'll receive the DVD as well so back to Ryan's answer what I wanted to say was in the program in the major league insider training program we do have an active warm-up that Ryan referred to we also have an upper body dynamic warm-up routine but for the guys and, the, and Ryan that's what I want you to follow do it anytime you before you work out your upper body whether you're doing upper body pulling workout or an upper body pushing workout you're going to do the same warm-up, okay? It's going to get blood flow into your muscles. It's going to get the, 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 your body temperature up and warm, and you'll be ready to go when you get you know, into your actual exercises. For the guys that, that haven't yet purchased the Insider Training Manual, I'm going to show it to you right now, and it looks something like this. So I'm going to step out back here in front of the camera. What we're going to do is get your arms moving in big circles. Forward. Now these things, I'm going to abbreviate a little bit here, but I would keep these things going for 30 seconds each. Now we're going to bring them back. So I'm going back. What I'm trying to get here is open up my chest. Let my shoulders rotate. Okay, now we come bring them across our arms. Everything's nice and loose. Bounce them across the chest. Again, open the arms up, close them down. Now let's swing them out, up and down. Swing them out, nice and loose. You can feel this through your middle back. You can feel it through your shoulders. Okay, now we're going to lean it over and fly it back. Okay, nice and loose. Let them hang, let them cross. Good. Up into a scarecrow. Keep your arms up. Just flop them down. 90 degrees, flop them down. In and out. Internal rotation, external rotation. Great for you throwers out there. Okay, now we're just going to bring it across the body. One arm across and turn. Turn. Okay. Kind of engaging our core, working the back of our shoulder. Okay, flip it over the other side. Cross. Good. Triceps up. Get the rib cage. See, we're moving through everything though here, guys. Everything's a, a movement. We're not just standing and stretching. We're moving through every movement here. Okay, bring it down. Kind of tap our toe here and swing our arms out. We're getting our whole trunk, our hips, our ankles. Okay, and then we're going to drop it down and do a windmill. And I'm starting to get a little bit out of breath, and that's good because I'm raising my core temperature up and getting my heart rate up. Then we come in here, we're going to grab our forearms okay, in all directions. Down, palm up, palm down, thumb out. Okay. 
And guys, that's pretty much it. It's a nice, quick routine. Again, we're going to try to stick to 30 seconds on every movement. And just really concentrating on progressing through every single movement from one to the next to the next without resting. So, Ryan, I hope that answered your question. I hope that helps all you guys out there that have yet to buy the book. If you haven't, get on board. I'm telling you guys, it's the best strength and conditioning manual you'll ever get your hands on. It's endorsed by some of the top guys in, in baseball and actually right now some of the hottest players in baseball. So uh, jump on board. Guys, I'm happy to be able to bring these messages to you from now on in this format. Give me some feedback. Click on the comments below this video and tell me whether you like this delivery or not. And again, ask those questions. The Load to Explode DVD is yours if I select your question. Guys, hang in there. I'll see you next week. Keep hitting and best in health in baseball.